Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Kelsey and this is another Chrome Music Lab tutorial that has been requested by one of my subscribers on my channel. So this particular subscriber requested that I write the Sonic Adventure 2 City Escape theme song and I'm actually like I'm more of a Mario fan than a Sonic fan. I did watch Sonic growing up and I played a little bit of Sonic, but I definitely had more time with Mario than Sonic. So, you know, if you're a Sonic fan, don't come at me with it. However, this song is really, really, really cool. So before we really dig into this tutorial, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the bell to be notified of every time I create a new Crow Music Lab tutorial and to give this video a thumbs up. It helps support me and this channel. And of course, if you are insisting on a link because you just do not simply have enough time to watch my tutorials, those links are gonna be down below in my description box for just a small fee. I believe that is only fair considering I spend a lot of time and effort writing these songs and creating the YouTube tutorial songs just for you. So I appreciate your understanding on that. And what are we waiting for? Let's dig in. All right, you are opening SongMaker. So first things first we're gonna do, we're gonna open up our settings. So for the length, we're gonna use the full 16 bars. So go all the way up 16 and that truly is how high you can go and four beats per bar and then split beats into four and as always for the scale chromatic so we can use as many notes as possible or at least have the freedom to use as many notes as possible and instead of two octaves we're going to do three now you can pause at any point in the video if you need to make sure your settings are right or if your instruments are right or if everything's lined up the way that I'm going to present it in my video. You're always welcome to do that. So when you're ready, you click on that blue check mark. So it should look like this. Now for the tempo, we're gonna use all the way up to 240 beats. And you'll hear why in a little bit. So it's super, super fast. We're going to stay on electronic and because Sonic is based off of a video game, I thought it would be best appropriate to use synth. So you'll click all the way to synth here. Now the very first thing we're going to do, you're going to make sure you scroll all the way down and all the way at the beginning. And when we do that, we are going to do percussion first. So I like to work from the bottom all the way to the top. So first thing we're going to do on that very first bar, circle. Now into the next bar, circle, skip, circle. In this next bar, nothing. So on the fourth bar, circle. So now we're starting into a new section and that's going to be circle, and then into the next bar, circle, skip, circle. Into the next bar, nothing. Next bar, circle. Now we're moving into a white section where we are gonna do the circle, next bar, circle, skip, circle. And then skip this bar and then in the fourth bar of the white section, we're gonna do circle. Okay. So now we should have, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. So 12 bars. So in the beginning of this, we're gonna go into the next bar, circle. Next bar, circle, skip, circle. Next bar, nothing. Into the next bar, circle. We should start into a white section, which is beginning there, circle. Next bar, circle, skip, circle. And then next bar, circle. 
And so this leaves nothing here. We're starting a gray section, which is circle, next bar, circle, skip, circle, next bar, nothing, last bar of the gray section, circle. And then moving back to a white section here, where we will start with circle, next bar, circle, skip, circle, next bar, nothing, next bar, circle. So you may notice that there's a pattern and that's okay. So we're now going to change it up a little bit here when we change into the gray section. So in the gray section, we do have the circle. Now in this next bar, we skip two split beats, one, two, circle into the next bar, circle. And then for the final bar for the gray section, circle. Now we're starting back on white. We're in the white section. We're gonna do circle, next bar, circle, skip, circle, next bar, nothing. Final bar of the white section, circle. Going into gray, got that same pattern going again. So circle, next bar, circle, skip, circle, nothing. Final bar, circle. Same pattern again into the white, circle. Next bar, circle, skip, circle. Next bar, nothing, next bar, circle. So now this should be a gray section where it's going to be circle, skip, circle, skip, circle, sorry. So circle, next bar, circle, skip, circle, nothing, circle. And then we're starting another white section where it's circle, next bar, circle, skip, circle, next bar, circle. Ooh. All right. And then we should be getting into another gray section here at the end. So at the, the circle, so it should be the last bar, the white section, there should be nothing. So we start a gray section where there's circle, next bar, circle, skip, circle, and then circle, and then another circle here at the end. So I'm gonna scroll all the way to the very end where we start a new section here where it should be circle. And then next bar we skip two split beats, one, two, circle. Next bar, nothing. Next bar, circle followed by the next bar, circle. We skip this bar here. So second to last bar, circle. So that should be the percussion, which. So you may kind of be hearing the, the theme with the beats. So we're gonna move on. Now we're gonna add the first octave. So make sure you're scrolled all the way back down, all the way back at the beginning. So we're gonna be adding some moving notes here. So the very first bar, go up to the top. So where that light blue line is that divides the first and the second octave we're gonna add pink, and then to the next bar, another pink, skip the split beat here, and then go down one, two, three, to that blue, the only blue in Chrome Music Lab, in case you haven't noticed. Now in the next bar, nothing. So in this bar here, we're gonna add that dark purple here. Starting into a gray section, we do that same pattern again, so that's pink, next bar, pink, skip a split beat, blue, next bar, nothing, into the next bar, dark purple. 
Now in this next section here, we're actually going to go down one and start on blue, next bar, blue, into the next bar, nothing, followed by in this next bar here, we are going to be adding that golden yellow or light orange, depending on how you see it. So then that goes into a gray section. So in the gray section, we're gonna add that blue, next bar, blue, into the next bar, nothing. So then in this next bar here, we are adding that regular green here. Next bar, we're actually going to use the, sorry, yellow, as you can see here. And if you need to go back, you can, or if you need to pause at any point, that's also okay. So I'm gonna keep going. Next bar, yellow, skip, yellow. Now we're gonna skip two bars here. So one, two, so starting into a gray section. So in that gray section, we're gonna do that yellow, Next bar, yellow, skip, yellow here. And then we're gonna skip a bar. So into this next bar here, we're gonna add that regular green. And then we're gonna do that same pattern again into the white section, which is the yellow. Next bar, yellow, skip, yellow. Skip this next bar and then follow into a yellow. We do start into a gray section where we will then do another yellow at the beginning of the gray section. Into this next bar, we skip two split beats. One, two, add the yellow. Into the next bar, we add the regular green. Next bar, we add the blue. Now, it should be noted that we're starting into a white section here, so in that white section, we're doing that same pattern like the beginning again. So pink, next bar, pink, skip, blue, into this next bar, nothing. So next bar, that dark purple. We're starting a gray section here now, and that's going to be the same pattern here that we just did. So the pink, next bar, pink, skip, blue, in the next bar, nothing. Next bar, uh, dark purple. So we got that. Now we're going to be doing into the white section again. We have the dark blue. Next bar, dark blue. And then skip two bars. So one, two of nothing. And then blue. Next bar, blue. So we got that again. Next bar, nothing, and then regular green for that next bar. So then we should be able to start into a white section here at the end, and that's going to be the yellow, next bar, yellow, skip, yellow, and then two bars of nothing. So one, two, so then here we got yellow, next bar, yellow, skip, yellow, skip, yellow. Into the next bar, we got, oh, the regular green. Next bar, regular green. So then we should be getting towards the end. So after this green, into the next bar, we skip two split beats. One, two, green again. Next bar, nothing. Next bar, green. And then this should be the gray section, which is the last uh, measure of the music. Got the blue, skip a bar, and then green. So then we should have something like, I know it doesn't sound like anything yet, but you know me, I like to add harmonies and moving lines to my music. 
So if you have been with me and been watching my tutorials since the beginning, you know I like to add those extra harmonies and notes to the music. So that's just how it is. So here's what we're gonna be doing. So what I'm going to be doing next is going to be for the second and third octaves because there's gonna be a lot of mixing going around. And I also wanna make sure that I save as much time as possible on these videos for you. So go all the way to the beginning and we're gonna use the second and third octaves here. Now, at the very beginning here, on that first bar, nothing. I'm gonna put nothing here. Now I will say uh, for the other blue line between the second and third octave or that middle and top octave, we're gonna start on the second bar with the pink, then go up three, one, two, three, the golden yellow, and then up two, one, two, to that green. Skip, and then skip to the next bar, sorry, where we do that same thing again. Next bar, same thing again, into the gray section. I know, easy so far, right? Isn't that great? Now into this next bar here, we're gonna skip two split beats. So one, two, so right here on that third split beat, we are going to add yellow and then that burnt orange, so that's two down from the yellow. And then into that second octave, we are then going to go all the way down so from this blue octave line, one, two, three, to that blue here. Now in the next bar, nothing. So into this next bar, we're gonna start with the golden yellow again, and then the pink, and then the blue. Now, we are then going to add a new section here uh, it should be white, where we're gonna do the blue, the pink, and then the burnt orange here. No interesting so far, huh? So, into the next bar, skipping two split beats again. So one, two, and then here we got the blue, the pink, and that golden yellow. Again, we skip this bar here, so in the beginning of the next bar, we build that blue, pink, and golden yellow again. So it should be like, all right, that's what we got so far. Now, get this, when we get into the gray section, there's not going to be too much happening for three bars. So it's after we build this chord here, that we're skipping three bars. So one, two, three. So then here, we're gonna just add a pink. So then into the white section here, we're gonna add the golden yellow, the pink, and the blue chord again. So, oh, I'm so sorry. So before this little pink note, here, um, when you go back one, nothing. So then here, we're gonna add in the second octave, so sorry, a golden yellow. So if you need to pause, that's my bad, I'm really sorry. So pause here just to make sure that's all good on your end and then skip. And then with this pink that I thought was gonna be by itself, we're gonna add the regular green and the golden yellow. So, so then moving on to the next bar. In the next bar here, we're gonna skip two split beats. One, two, so then here we got burnt orange, the blue, and then yellow. So that should be what we got. In the next bar, we're just adding 
the golden yellow here. Next bar, it's just gonna be in the second octave and that's gonna be the pink, the blue, and the yellow. And to the next bar, we're adding burnt orange, blue, and yellow. Next bar, we're skipping two split beads. So one, two, so then here, we're adding the pink, the blue, and the yellow here we skip this bar here so into the next bar we got the pink the blue and the yellow cord again now into the next bar which should be a white section so in this white section here we are adding the purple so the lighter purple the burnt orange in the third octave and then go up just a little and do the blue in that third octave. So then into that next bar from third octave down, skip two split beats, one, two, and then here, regular green, burnt orange, purple. We got that going on again. So you'll see why I did two and three octaves this time. So usually if it's a lot of stuff going on, I usually try to break it down a little easier. But there's so many things just kind of close together. So next bar, nothing. Next bar, we're adding the golden yellow and the purple. Now this next section here should be a gray section and that's gonna be purple, burnt orange, and that green again. We're skipping this bar here. So into this next bar, we are then doing the blue, the burnt orange, and one step down from the blue, and that's the green. Next bar will be the green, the purple, the light purple, and the burnt orange. So this is halfway. Okay, so then the next section, it's almost gonna kind of be like repeating a little bit, almost. So, not quite though. So we should be starting a white section. So we're skipping this bar. So into the next bar, we're building that pink, golden yellow, regular green cords again. So next bar, same thing. Next bar, same thing. And the next bar is the pink, golden, yellow, blue. So then in the next bar, we skip two split beats. One, two. So then here, we got golden, yellow. We got pink. And then go down to blue. Exciting things. Next bar, we got nothing. So into this next bar here, we're gonna do yellow and burnt orange and then go down regular green. So we got a lot of regular green action going on for this particular piece. Next bar, go up the third octave, put the regular green there, pink and then blue in the second octave. Next bar, skip two split beats, one, two, so here we got golden yellow, we got the pink, and then we got the blue. Next bar, nothing. So then this next bar here, we got same chord here, the golden yellow, the pink, and the blue. Do the same thing again in the next bar. And then next bar we have the golden yellow, the blue, the regular green. So also to add with these golden cords here with the, the, gold, the golden yellow, the pink and the blue, add another golden yellow, the bottom of each of those cords.
cords just to kind of add some flavor to it. Now, after this cord that we just built here, we're going to skip a split beat. So in this third split beat, add another gold at the bottom. And it'll make sense in a little bit why I wanted it that way. So I'm going to keep going. We're almost there. We're going to skip this next bar here. So in this final bar on the gray section, add a pink. Now starting a white section, we're adding the golden yellow, the blue, and then a yellow. I know that sounds really strange, but again, when it's all put together, like you'll hear why. In the next bar, skip two split beats. One, two, so then here, burnt orange, we got the blue. We got the yellow. Next bar, add a golden yellow. And that's it. Next bar, pink, blue, yellow. Into the next bar, which is a gray section. Burnt orange, blue, and yellow again. Next bar, we skip two split beats. One, two, here. We're adding pink, blue, yellow. Skip this bar, the beginning of this final fourth bar in the gray section, pink, blue, yellow. So now, dun, 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 we're getting towards the end. So now for these final two bars, we have purple, burnt orange, and then scrolling a little more up, we got oh, the blue. In the next bar, we skip two split beats. One, two, regular green, burnt orange, purple. We got that going on again. Skip the next bar. Skip the next bar, you'll see we're towards the end. So in this bar here, we're adding the purple, the burnt orange, the golden yellow. Now this final gray section, we are adding blue, burnt orange, golden yellow, regular green. Skip the next bar. And then finally, this final section here, blue, purple, burnt orange, blue, and then you should have That's what I consider the main theme of Sonic Adventure 2 City Escape. So again, I know I'm not like the biggest Sonic fan, but I heard the piece and I just thought it was really, really cool. So I hope you get an enjoyment out of it as well. So that's all I have for this tutorial. And if you do have any other uh, suggestions for future tutorials, please let me know down in the comments. Um, as you can see, since I followed a request of another subscriber for a song, I do take your songs into consideration and see if they do fit into the Crow Music Lab theme. And if it does, then I write it and do the tutorial for you. So thanks for tuning in. Make sure to check out my links and subscribe to my channel for future Crow Music Lab tutorials. And I will see you next time.